Hello everyone! Hi! It's us again. The, we're back. And we today we're talking about Dave's new diet, which I'm also doing. Um, yeah, so I've recorded this twice already, um, without him. And it just was, it was just really dry and didn't really get kind of what I wanted to say across. So um, I dragged him in to kind of... Because what's comedy. a diet without a friend, really? Oh, oh isn't that nice? I feel a bit sick. Um, right, so basically, um, my name is David. Oh, was I supposed to introduce <laughs> myself? Sorry. And I'm David as well. <laughs> And basically, we've done these videos. We've done these, this is our second video. Um, just to uh, we wanted to kind of vlog a little bit about things, and because we've got some good friends that vlog, uh, Steph and Dave, and um, they inspired us to vlog as such. And we haven't got that much to vlog about because you know we don't actually lead that interesting lives. I'm a travel agent, and David works for National Trust, but we. We um we we wanted to vlog a little bit about real life and about real people rather than kind of we don't want to be celebrities. This isn't this isn't for us to kind of go, yay, we can be on Celebrity Big Brother because no. Um but this is just for us to get normal thoughts and things out for everyone and well, as normal as we can be. Do, do apologise, everyone. I just realised that rather than looking at you guys, um, I was staring out the window while Dave was talking. So <laughs> that may look a bit weird. To be fair, we do um, have a really good view out the window. The, of, we, the, of the of the lovely view of Eastbourne and the Downs. Yeah, and when it's nice and daytime and we do another vlog, we will show you said view so you can all see for yourself. Anyway, let's go back to the point. So... The reason we're doing this is because uh, back in 2000, I was diagnosed as a diabetic, um, a type 2 diabetic that was um, being controlled by tablets and diet. Well, that worked well. Um, I, I've not always been bad. I've not always been good. But recently I've been worse than I've been bad more than good. And this year we did go, um, I did go to Slimming World between January and May and I did lose two stone, which to this day I've managed to keep that two stone off, which I think is a, for me is a marvellous achievement. Um, but I probably kept it off at the detriment to my diabetes, so um, that's a bad thing. Um, there's not enough education about diabetes, and about, especially about type 2 diabetes, and what it can do and what happens to you when you grow older. Um, I'm only 34 and um, two weeks ago I had an infection in my toe and I was in hospital for 10 days and are you laughing? I wasn't laughing. <laughs> you seem like you're smirking. I wasn't. And um, I was in hospital for 10 days and they decided that actually the infection had got into my bones. I had, um, what was it called? Osteomyelitis. That's the one. Um, and the surgeon just said, yeah, no, we need to take your toe off. So they did. Um, so my second toe on my left foot in from the big toe has been removed. It's healing very nicely. I'm having the stitches out on this coming Thursday. It's delightful. He loves it. He loves dressing yeah. it and, you know, being nerfed. It's surprisingly interesting to look at. The, yeah. I would go as far as saying delightful. Um, but, um, so the, I'm just drinking tea in my NASA. My, yeah. my NASA American. NASA from Florida. Yeah, but, Florida cup. Which yeah. there is a, there is a video coming about Florida. Um, we just haven't got around to it yet. Yeah. So for those of you that are waiting for the video, um, <laughs> we'll be waiting a little bit longer. Not much um, longer. We're going to get our act we, together and do it. Yeah, we've basically just not started because there's been so much else going on. Yeah, health problems really. But anyway, um, so what we're going to do is I'm I'm going to follow a diet um, that's revolutionised the diabetic world apparently. Um, and for anyone who is British and watches the BBC, you, um, you might have seen a science programme with a presenter called Michael Mosley, and he's a very good doctor and um, scientist. And he was diagnosed with type 2 diabetes a few years ago, and he invented the five. I say invented. He came up with the five two diet, which is hugely popular. And by doing the five two diet, he reversed some of his diabetes. Um, He's now come up with the blood sugar diet, which um, enables you to lose fat around your liver and pancreas so they can work better. 
and in some of the cases of people with diabetes normally people up to about eight years um, have been diagnosed by diabetes they have reversed their diabetes altogether so they're no longer diabetic which is amazing um, because I've had mine for 16 years I may not get rid of it or it may not be cured but it will it will definitely be less um, difficult to control and well managed and I won't have any of the complications such as more amputations or anything like that and you might you might have to you might be able to stop taking any uh, medication Medica yeah I might be stopping medication on it altogether because my blood sugars will be finally under control properly um, so David's going to show you the book because he's my lovely wonderful assistant oh, oh, oh that is that one that's it well done there we go. so it's the eight week sorry the eight week blood sugar diet by Dr Michael Mosley with the all the research and you can take it down there all the research is done by um, Professor Roy Taylor of the Newcastle University um, and he's done hundreds and thousands of studies of this, even with um, uh, scientists in Sweden and doctors in Sweden and Finland and Norway, Scandinavian countries have done this experiment and it's worked. So basically what it is, um, there are, I've written some notes, so do, do, do apologise for that. Um, it goes on for eight weeks is the first part of the diet. So the blood sugar diet is eight weeks at 800 calories a day. Now, some of you might hear that and think, what, how on earth can anyone live or survive on 800 calories a day? Um, and oh, you know, diets, you know, really fast weight loss plans don't ever work, blah, 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 blah. This has worked. This has been proven to work in all the research and all the, you know, the kind of things I've read. So it does work. It just takes a lot of discipline, which normally I really struggle with, but I've got him to help me. So, um, yeah. Um, so it follows three principles, which is the diet itself, um, getting active, which we've got a brand new beautiful exercise bike, which we are trying to do at least 20 to 30 minutes a day. This isn't the exercise bike, no. this is Dave. The exercise bike is behind us, but um, obviously you can't see it, so we're just doing a bit of jazz hands to uh, He's doing show jazz that. Hands um, the, the third principle is sorting out your head. So basically it... Um, it asks you to meditate or just have 20 minutes of just silent time with your own thoughts and trying to blank out the stresses of the day so you don't get tempted to eat kind of you know the foods we reach for like crisps chocolate biscuits ice cream anything really um this is why i'm this big um anyway so eight weeks 800 calories and then you go on to phase two or the life plan which is the Mediterranean diet 5-2 version. So you do a 5-2 diet, so five days a week, eat what you want, two days a week, 800 calories. And you do it with a Mediterranean lifestyle. So, you know, I'm not saying go to Greece or Malta or Italy or anything, but you eat, um, what do you eat? Berries, fruits, nuts, fish, meat, chicken. That is meat. But the point is, you eat meat, and you, you have really, you kind of really cut down on the carbs, complete cut down on the carbs, which you know for years everyone's going, oh, you have to eat carbs of everything, and um, you know carbs are your friends, fat isn't your friend, meat isn't good for you, this isn't good for you. In fact, for fact, it's now turned around that Dr. Atkins was right, and that a low carb diet is the way to go. So that's what they're now prescribing in hospitals to diabetics, which is quite astonishing, really. They've uh -huh. changed their tune. Um, so anyway, that's the plan. Just want to clarify, we're not doctors. So <laughs> DM, yeah, don't follow my advice. This is the advice that we have read in the book. Yeah, get the, the book. This is not us advising people. No, I'm not advising you to do anything. any sort of medical uh, no. diagnosis. If you have concerns, go to your doctor. That's <laughs> See a GP. That's what you need um, to do. Don't come to us for advice. We really are not doctors. But we're sort of doing this so that we can tell you um, what it's like where we're starting from and then what the journey's like um, the, for both of us really um, the, the journey's going to be hell yeah for the first two weeks um, apparently mood swings are not good and but I'm not good with mood swings am I no <laughs> the, um, <laughs> to anyway. be fair though neither am I so this could be quite it's interesting um, um, the, um, yeah. so what does 800 calories look like a day well I've got my menu for the first few days in front of us. So um, you're supposed to have meal replacement um, drinks for breakfast or lunch. 
Um, well done. And um, yeah, but they can't see that. So just put it down. Um, but just to give you an idea. Yeah, we planned it because you know, f you know, failing to repair is to prepare to fail. Cheesy. Yeah, I know, but it was in a what was it in Scouts or something? I don't know. Anyway, the point is, um, we're starting tomorrow, and for breakfast I'll be having a slim fast shake. Um, other non <laughs> other diet drinks are available. <laughs> other meal replacement drinks are available. meal replacement drinks are available. Um, and then for lunchtime I'll be having um, carrots. <laughs> this sounds really bad. Carrots, pepper, uh, cucumber, and homemade hummus. Oh no, I've still got hummus in the fridge. I'll use that one first. Yeah. Yeah. So hummus. Using stuff up before it runs out. I know. How oh, weird is that? Oh, just, just chucking it away. Um, yes. Yeah, so we're going to have a, a crudité and hummus lunch. And then in the evening we have... Well, I have. Cause, no, I'm having the lunch. He's going to work. Um, in dinner we're having lettuce bowls with mushroom and hoisin chicken. Which sounds amazing, actually, to be honest. Um, and all of that, all of those calories come to a total of 739 Oh, actually, no, it's not. It's 769 because that's 230. But anyway, so 769. But um, that's still really good. It's under the 800. And I can eat fruit as snacks, and you know, I can drink tea, I can still drink Diet Coke. I don't drink a lot of it, but. Um, and Iron Brew. Diet. No, Iron Brew Zero from Morrison's. It's the best drink ever, I have to say. Quite like it. Um, so that's that. You know, that's my first day, and then like throughout the week, I'm having a melon, spinach, and blueberry shake, um, beetroot falafel. Uh, what else are we having? Spicy turkey and apricot burgers, um, chickpea and hazelnut salad, and uh, bake in a bag fish with lemon couscous. Sounds actually really quite nice. I'm really quite looking forward to it. Um, the novelty of the diet will wear off in the first four days. However, we are going to vlog every day, like snippets of us preparing the breakfast, the dinners, the lunches, eating them, and just our general mood for the day and how we feel. David's mm. not doing it. He's not doing the 800. I'm not doing the diet, thing. Really sticking to it rigidly, no. simply because although I need to lose a few pounds, the um, basically, if I, yeah, if I lose more than about. 12 kilos then I'll, be I'll lose him in the wind I'll, yeah I'll blow away so the um, yeah. um, but this is more the, for me but he's trying to support me there's a bit of tummy fat going on so the um, um <laughs> the so yeah. yeah so the diet I'm sort of doing bits of it um, to support Dave and also for my own sort of uh, own weight health. loss as yeah. well yeah so, um, but he'll get more active as well because he's doing the five, uh, the the couch to five k, and next year he is doing the, uh, uh, what's it called, Seven Sisters Marathon, Beachy Head Marathon, Beachy Head Marathon with his good friend Catherine and Rona and Rona. As well. the, Rona um, so um, the um, uh, Rona, if you decide to back out of this, uh, <laughs> it's on uh, the internet. Now. <laughs> yeah, you so, can't, you can't um, not do it. Sorry about that. So Catherine's going to put down the wine again. For her training for marathon, which you'd like to that because yeah. you know last time it was a nightmare. Um, that was David's words, not mine. Um, <laughs> she's not gonna see this. She is gonna see this. Um, yeah, basically that that's the diet we're doing and that's the plan of action. Um, it's gonna last for eight weeks, which takes me up to my birthday weekend, um, which is really good, and that's when I go on to the five two diet. Um, I will have a bit of a blowout on my birthday weekend because we're having my first ever child. Uh, no, that's, that sounds really weird. You're having your first I'm ever having, child. I'm having my that's first. really not a good place to Shish. stop that sentence. Shish. I'm having my first <laughs> ever child party. Because I never first had when I was little. Style party. Yeah, when I was little, I never had a kids yeah. party because my my birthday was always in the holidays and no one ever wanted to come to my party because I was the kid that no one liked. Um, so sad. <laughs> so I never got one. Um, so instead, um, I wanted one this year, and we're going to do one. And we're going to do fancy dress as well. So I'm going as Buzz Lightyear. Davey's going as Woody. Yay! Because you know I've not done that before. Um, that sounds really weird. Um, but everyone else is going to come dressed as a Disney character as well. So look out for the video and the photos for that because it will be up. <laughs> I say as soon as it happens, but. Yeah, it's taken us, you know, six months to do the video for Florida, to be honest. But um, three months, three months, three months. It will get up. It will get up there sometime in the next couple of weeks. 
Um, so that's about it, really. No, it will. I'm going to have to do it myself. Um, so, <laughs> so that's it for now. Um, I'm, yeah, we're going to go now and just plan the rest of my week, really, because it does take a lot of planning and preparation. But it is eight weeks hard work mm-hmm. of dieting and, and exercise. And, you know, hopefully I'll be back at work in two weeks, which two weeks, a week. Not two weeks. Karen, if you're watching this, I'll be back next week. Um, but yeah, <laughs> yeah, I'll be back next week. Fine. Um, but yeah, I'll be back to work because I've had to have the last couple of weeks off because of the the operation. So yeah, um, and I'm getting really bored that I'm playing garden games and stuff on my computer. I'm glad you clarified that's on your computer and not out in our, <laughs> we our don't wonderful have, garden. We have a balcony. We, we don't have one. We're on first floor flat. So yeah. the um, is that in the garden? I don't know who's. Um, <laughs> Anyway, the point is, um, I'm getting bored and I can't wait to go back to work. What I don't want at work, though, girls, if you're looking at this and watching this, please don't bring in the crap. Please don't bring the donuts or the sweets or the crisps or the chocolates or whatever. You know, there's just piles of it in the office all the time. Don't do it. Not when I'm there. Do it when I'm not there. It's not a problem. Um, Or if you are there and you are bringing it in, make sure that I'm not eating it because I don't want to do that. Do I? No, exactly. Um, if you are going to bring stuff like that in, make sure you bring a bag of carrot sticks and some hummus. Because <laughs> it's always a great alternative. Do you know what? I love a carrot. Yep. Carrots and hummus are my favourite. You favorite can't thing have right a now. cake. <laughs> if you can't have, have a carrot. When you want cake, have a carrot. Mm. And for anyone who doesn't watch Miranda, shame on you. But that's from Miranda. It's one of one of the matches they say, and I just absolutely you know, just love it. So, what's that? It's amazing. It's a car, David. It's like a car horn, I think. Um, anyway, we're rambling. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe. This button somewhere here. It's not actually on the screen. It's not going to be anywhere on the screen because we're not that technically advanced. Maybe up there. We're not technically advanced with um, YouTubers yet. But subscribe, like, and join. Um, any questions, comments, nice ones. Don't be horrible. Um, but yeah, just say some nice things. Give us lots of support and encouragement. That'd be really good. And the next video upload will be probably in a week's time once we've done a full seven days or something, and or maybe a few days. You can see how we are on day one um, compared to day four. And uh, yeah, um, yeah, just keep happy watching. watching really. Happy really. watching. See, um, and Have a great that's YouTube also day. Doing the blood sugar diet. Um, good luck. Yes. Um, the, um, um, uh, let us know how you get on. Yeah, comment if you're doing it yourself. Um, what you find easy, what you find difficult. Um, everything really we want it to be a journey with people rather than you know that's the thing at the moment there's only videos out there for men who want to get fit in England in the UK it just seems every diet video is either a woman or a guy going this is how you lose weight and get fit and I, I want to get is, fit but I don't want to I, I can't be yeah. muscly and toned we and find like that, that a lot of the videos for men for getting fit are really about body image still so they're about making yourself look buff they're about making yourself look really toned um and this is about being healthy yeah um and this is um having a healthy lifestyle um and yeah. shedding some weight in the meantime exactly. so um the, yeah we just hope this is useful for some people and i hope it is yeah even if just one person kind of gets something out of it and and picks up the book and reads the book um or even if you just want to get healthy yourself and you think oh, actually that's quite a good idea i'll do that um chat to us let us know what's going on um any suggestions any recipes or um questions and answers and stuff like that we can do as well um we're not copying our friends good old good old ks um but yeah that's about it really isn't it so happy viewing happy vlogging and um we'll see you on the other side soon See you soon. Bye. Bye.